as your fairy godbrother and as a dating coach for 14 years, I want to let you know that men put women into different categories. And it's not the simplistic wifey material, not wifey material categories. There are five categories that men put women into, and I wanted to share those with you so that you understand kind of what's what. Okay, so the first category is the desperate girl. And the desperate girl is all the girl that's chasing, emailing him, texting him, trying to earn his love. That's the lowest of the low, no shade. And if, if you don't know if you're this girl, if you are always initiating conversations, texts, and if the only reason that he's reaching out is because he wants something or needs something for, for you or is asking money, you're probably in the desperate girl category. That's category number one. Category number two is the good time girl. This is the girl that he hooks up with. Oftentimes, these are the girls that he doesn't want to be seen in public with. That's will try to put you in a box, so don't let them do that. The, if you want to figure out if you're this girl, if he is giving you what you do in text, or if he's messaging you after 10 p.m., or if he's taking you out on dates outside of the city center, you're probably in this category. So that's category number two, the, the good time girl. The third category is the good enough girl. This is a tricky category because he's doing like the bare minimum and things are okay. He's not mean, he's not rude, um, but he's not doing the extra things. He's not, he's getting you gifts for your birthday, he's getting you gifts for Valentine's Day, but he's not doing the small and special things to put you over the top, to really value and cherish you. If you wanna know if you're in this category, uh, you have to understand and think, am I always having to ask him to do things and he's, is he not doing them the first time around? If not, he is. he's probably put you in the category of a good enough girl because a guy that is like in love with the entire package is gonna need to hear things once and he's just gonna do them, okay? The fourth category is the dream girl category. So the difference between dream girl and the kind of good enough category is the dream girl, he loves the whole package and he's gonna do the little stuff in between, the random flowers, right? He's going to take care of things without you asking him to do so. Um, the, the thing that you have to be aware of, and this is the category that you want to be in, is you want to make sure that you're not performing. A lot of girls will be in this dream girl category and he, he will want to do all of these things for you, but then you feel like, oh my God, I have to be some, some this like curated version of myself and not my real self. Don't do that, girl, yeah? The fifth category and is the out of your league category. Um, and this is where the woman comes from wealth, more education, um, has a bigger job or prestige than the guy, and he's doing everything that he can to be a part of that prestige to lift himself up. And so what happens though is after a while, if he doesn't feel like he's satisfying her needs, he will cheat or he will try to humble her in a certain kind of way to bring her down to his level and his status so he doesn't feel as inadequate. So those are the five different categories that men put women in. Um, please understand that if you find yourself in one of these categories that doesn't fully serve you, I can def definitely help you get out of it because there are deeper things happening that you're gonna have to heal from if you want to level up. So book a call with me if you want, but I hope that this is helpful for you.